Yo everybody, what's going on? Shane or Sinead here, back with another video. Um, so we are actually diving the state line of Coeur d'Alene, or uh, of Idaho and Washington today. So we're gonna go under, there's a few bridges that we're gonna try to go under. Um, I'm not sure how bad the current is today. It's actually like really early. I don't know if you can see over there, the sun's just coming up. It's like 7 a.m. But we're out here grinding early in the morning. Um, so yeah, that's what we're gonna do today. Uh, got my, just setting up my gear over here and we're gonna hop right into it. <clears throat> it's supposed to, I've been here once before. It was really nice. Um, I actually almost got run over by a boat here. It's kind of scary, but it's, it's cool. I, uh, it was probably my fault, let's be honest. Um, but yeah, we're gonna jump right into it. I'm gonna hit in the, get in the water. Sorry, it's really early. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys in the water. Peace. Look at that, right there already, guys. <laughs> Little CO2 canister. Look at that, already. That's pretty funny. Okay, ready? 
Yo guys, what's going on? We just jumped out of the water, finished diving. Um, it was an awesome dive. I enjoyed it so much. Saving that fish, by far my favorite part of the dive. Also cleaning up all the trash. Um, so I told myself today on this dive, I'm not gonna go for like amazing stuff or you know, go to an amazing place. I'm gonna go to a place where I know there's a lot of trash, a lot of lures that uh, fish will eat, and I'm gonna try and clean it up a little bit. So that was the goal for today. And I was, you know, if I find something cool, I find something cool along the way. But I am so happy with today. I got a lot of lures out, saved that fish, and you know, a lot of trash out as well. So I'm gonna go through and show you guys all the stuff I found. It was a really fun dive. Um, so let's just jump into it. All right, guys, let's start over here with the, just like the trashy parts. So, uh, like, you know, I'm not even sure what either, like, you know, a plastic bag. I'm not sure what that green thing is, honestly. There's some uh, line wrapped around it because I couldn't get it untangled. But uh, yeah. Then we have this. I'm not sure what it was used for. There's holes on the bottom, maybe like cold fish or something, but found it down there. And uh, yeah, brought it up. <coughs> then we're gonna go over to all the cans and the bottle I found. Uh, we got some broken glass, just a bunch of different cans. Really glad I could get all those out. Um, that was definitely, you know, it's just a nice thing to do. I love doing it. All right, we'll move down. We have some just like 
rope, I guess, and some lures, a bunch of lures. There's some more that I think I lost along the way or that are like caught in my bag over there that I can't get out, so. <laughs> but uh, this is most of them. And we'll go to, I don't know what this is. Honestly, it's a handle to something, but I'm not sure like what it goes to exactly. And then we have a, C, a CO2 canister, which is pretty cool. Never found one of those underwater. That's that's awesome. I found it and I was just standing there too. <laughs> I didn't even get in the water yet. I was putting on my fins. But, uh, and then we got some golf balls. You know, fun to find, fun to find. And then we're going to move over to the big stuff. All right, so we got the sunglasses. Those are always cool to find. Love finding them. And then we have this. So it's a box. There is something in it. I have no idea what it is though. So I'm going to open it with you guys and we'll see what's inside. It looks like a bag of some sort. All right guys, I'm gonna open this and I'll come back to you when I get it open. Yo guys, all right, so I was about to open that box and I got it a little bit open and um, it kind of hit me. Like why would there be a random box with a bag in it? Um, Cause I, you know, I opened it a little bit and I saw the bag. So there is a bag in there and what I thought might be dirt, I don't think is dirt. I think it might be um, some human remains. So we're gonna go put that back right now. Um, I'll show you the box, it's it's right here. Um, so this is the box, I was about to open it. I got the, the lid open right here just a little bit and I saw the bag in there. Um, and you know, I'm, I'm, I'm like 99% sure they're human remains. So we are gonna go put them back at the, um, where I found them, exactly where I found them and then I'll come back to you guys. But yeah, I'm gonna show you me putting them back because <clears throat> I don't wanna mess with anybody's remains. I would show you guys, you know, the inside, but that's somebody's family member possibly and I don't wanna mess with that. So we're gonna go put it back right now and I'll talk to you guys when I get back. All right guys, so we have the box right here. We're about to go put it right back where I found it. Um, yeah, I'll show you guys. All right guys, so I just got back from putting the uh, box of remains um, back where I found it, or yeah, back where I found it. So uh, it feels good to put them back. I felt really bad taking them out. I didn't know until I got them on land, obviously, and kind of opened it a little bit, but then it clicked in my brain. <clears throat> I'm just glad I could put them back in the rightful place and you know where I found them. But uh, that's gonna be it for me for right now. All right guys, thank you, peace. This could be us. So back to what I was saying. <laughs>